hi guys welcome back to my channel i know you guys missed me it's just been a week of that. today's makeup look is gonna be a bold makeup look you know i told you guys i like a pattern to my youtube video which is like a bold and natural bold and natural i think i didn't keep to that for like two videos i'm done now because i did the 15 minutes makeup challenge with my best friend and then i went up, um, on to do morphe eye makeup tutorial which is what the morphe 350 makeup video that was also a natural makeup look so i felt like you know what i've done two natural natural makeup look in a row and I haven't even done my bold makeup look like I always want to follow up. I know a lot of you people would be like well you've already done a, a makeup video that looks exactly like this. Not really guys. The last one I did was the anti valentine's makeup look and my eye makeup was more like a cut crease purple kind of thing but yeah i was wearing a black lipstick but today i decided to go all black today yeah once it go black i'll never go back <laughs> anyways so i decided to do um a black eye makeup tutorial a black lip black outfit as you can see i'm wearing a black outfit today my jewelry is black my ring is also black my earring is black i just i don't know i don't know what went into me i just said to do all black makeup tutorial today i don't even know what i'm gonna call it yet but i feel like that's what i'm gonna call it all black makeup tutorial and for today's look i got my inspiration from black swarm i know it's a very very old movie but i was watching it recently with my partner and i'm like you know what i'm gonna try and do a whole black makeup look because it's amazing plus i'm going out tonight so i'm as i was like you know what let's use this opportunity to you know video this bold uh, makeup look for my my youtubers i know i've been rambling a lot so i'm gonna stop talking now and we're gonna jump into the makeup look but before we do that please don't forget to like this video if you like it don't forget to subscribe if you're not yet subscribed to my channel why are you doing that also click on the bell button right next to the subscribe button if you're doing that you get notification whenever i upload a new video and don't also forget to share this video with your families and friends if you love it and if you want to invite them to my word don't also forget to comment in the comment box below if you guys have any particular makeup look you would like me to create for you guys like i always say i would try my best to get it done i'm trying as much as possible to be myself now on camera because i feel like i'm more like a robot well now i'm trying to like you know <laughs> bring my crazy side out for you guys to see anyways without any further ado let's jump into this makeup look and i will see you guys in my next video bye guys <laughs> so i've gone ahead to do my left eye and i've also done my eyebrows so if you guys want to see how i do my eyebrow i'm going to leave the link in my description bar make sure you check that out so the first thing i'm going to start by doing is priming my eyes and today i will be priming it with my LA girl pro concealer in the shade top Now I'm going to be going in with my tape to help me get a cleaner and sharper and look. So the first thing I'm going to do is go into my Morphe palette and I'm going to pick up the orange shade right here and use that as my transition color today. Now I'm going to be going into my BH Cosmetic 28 color palette Smoky Eye Edition. I'm going to be using this black shade right here to help me get the black eye makeup look I'm going for. With that also I'm going to be going back and forward with this orange, dark orange shade in the Morphe palette to help me get more like a rusty smoky eye. is done guys today I'm gonna to be priming my face with my Rimmel London Stay Matte Face Primer for 
foundation today i'll be using my stila stay all day foundation and concealer I don't like the way the brush is applying my foundation so I'm going to be going into my Root Technique Beauty Sponge. It's a bit dirty but I'm going to quickly use that. To conceal my under eye today I'll be using my LA Girl Pro Concealer in the shade Pure Beige. To cream contour my face today, I'll be using my LA Girl Pro Concealer in the shade Dark Cocoa. I'm going to start by blending out my under eye concealer with my Real Technique Beauty Sponge. as I blend out because I've noticed my under eye is always easy to crease up so I'm going to use my Benign Banana Lottery Powder to set it while I blend out. my contour with my pro artist bronzer palette and today I'll be picking up this shade right here to contour my face So while my concealer is baking, I'm quickly going to apply my lashes and today I'll be using my Red Cherry Wispy Lashes. And I'll be gluing on my lashes with my Dew Glue. While my lashes is getting ready to be glued on, I'm going to quickly apply my mascara and today I'll be using my Max Factor Mascara in the shade Black. <laughs> set the all of my face today I decided to go into my bronzer palette and use this shade right here now I'm going to be going back to my BH cosmetic palette and picking up the black shade again this time around I'm going to be applying it to my own back. I'm going to be lining my waterline with my model own gel eyeliner. Now I'm going to be spraying my face with my MAC Fix Plus. Now I'm 
going to be alighting my face with my Anastasia Beverly Hills Glow Kit and this is the Sun Drip palette. Today I'll be mixing two shades together and I'll be using the bronze and the sun shade. to my max factor mascara this time around i'm going to be applying it to my bottom lashes lipstick that i'm going to be using today is my kylie lip kit this is a dead of night it's a very nice matte black shade so i've been dying to use it so finally today i'm going to get to use it today thing i'm going to do is line it with the lip liner gonna tidy up my lips with my LA Girl Pro Concealer in the shade Toffee. When I'm done with my lips I'm quickly gonna add crystal to this part of my eyes like that. So what I'm gonna do I'm gonna go back to my dew glue. I'm just gonna create a dot where I want to apply the crystal. I don't have the exact tool to apply this, so I'm just going to improvise with using my long nails. 